Hey guys, this is Mark, and uh, it's gonna be a quick video. It's uh, it's probably around 11 o'clock p.m. here, and I just had a big problem, you know, with my mayor lemon tree. And what I noticed recently, there was a lot of ants around my pots, around my plants, on top of my uh, mayor lemon tree, and I think I have found a problem. I don't know if you guys see, but there's basically a colony of ants inside my pot. All right, and it was just, I've been killing those ants for past few days with different type of things and I just couldn't figure out what it is. So I just had this big sheet of, uh, in the middle of my floor and I kinda, I'm kinda doing emergency surgery here at 11 o'clock PM, but I just couldn't, couldn't get over like what's going on. Looks like there's a lot of those ants moving a lot of white eggs. You can guys see over here. And this is one of the problem, uh, you know that I never came across did some research looks like borax uh, which is uh, which is kind of like detergent uh, supplement or something like that you can buy it in any grocery store you know when and eats it uh, it actually takes it back to colony and and actually can kill in, uh, the colony all right guys uh, I'm temporarily done I just dump all this stuff here the mayor tree is right there in this temporary pot. For now, it should be good. Tomorrow, I'm gonna go to Home Depot and just get a nice big uh, clay pot for this tree. You know, it's been a long time. I had this tree for maybe two years. You know, I drew a lot of holes, but look at this. Uh, looks like uh, bottom of the root system was just, you know, just, just falling apart and it's just, stay away from the plastic pots guys stay away unless you can if you see it maybe like just a lot of bark and you know you really really have a good drainage maybe a smaller pot maybe that that will work but uh i'll never ever you never see you're never gonna see me use a plastic pot ever again so uh let me show you oh. Let's see if i can zoom in as you can guys see here just a bunch of different bugs ants crawling I'm not sure if these are like uh, queens or not, but you know, the infestation was just unbelievable. Hey guys, uh, so this is the next day. Uh, I just ran to Home Depot and bought this 14, five gallon, 14 inches, five gallon uh, pot. And like I said, guys, getting rid of all the plastics. Okay, I got, I got two left, actually three right here. We got some uh, time growing, but uh, you know, I got those last three pots left and there's never again in my life I'm gonna buy plastic pots. It's just too much problem. Uh, you know, especially if your if your soil doesn't have a good drainage, you know, you really just gonna keep, you know, you're gonna have a lot of problems with your plants. So definitely, you know, a clay pot pots you know, it's the only way to go. It can transfer moisture easy in and out, especially if you live in Florida. Another thing that I have learned uh when I pulled this uh tree, you know, all the root system was just crumbling and falling apart and one of the reasons was basically the root system was cooked just because the plastics you know heats up so quick and it transfer you know the heat inside the soil you know without you know allowing it to escape where a clay pot it basically you know when it heats up it it the, the, the clay pot allows the soil to cool down by releasing moisture you know through the wall so uh, so this is you know that's what the you know pot looks like very nice much bigger not bigger actually but uh, a little bit taller and uh, more narrow which I kind of like and and here we don't really hit have much after shock you know so far so hopefully you know we got a lot of new growth coming up we have this one <laughs> one actually lemon that it's it's been here since actually maybe two months ago three months ago and it's still here you know still growing so we're just gonna let it grow we're gonna let uh, the tree recover. We got beautiful soil. We got a potting gold, uh, uh, black gold potting soil, which is which has very, very good drainage. And um, I added some premium warm castings to it. A little bit of fertilizer. I'm waiting for my uh, citrus tree fertilizer that's coming probably this week. But uh, you know, as you can guys see here, a lot of new growth coming up here on the bottom. So hopefully this tree is going to do much better this season. I'm going to keep you guys updated. So guys, thank you guys for watching. Please subscribe. I got some tomatoes growing there in those smaller pots. I'm going to keep you updated. My uh, avocado tree right here. But uh, if you haven't subscribed yet, please do so. I'll be making some more videos for you guys. So thank you for watching. See you next time. Bye-bye.